<laughs> You're so funny, Lyle. Thank you so much. I'm so glad we're moving in together. I am also glad. What? Oh. Just. Oh. My God! They found me! Lyle, what's happening? Oh, no. Not tonight. Not now. Not with you here. Lyle, quit fooling around. My name isn't Lyle. It's Rudger Haversham. Lieutenant Rudger Haversham. I work for the COA. The CIA. Fuck the CIA. The COA. It's an organization. What do those letters stand for? If only there were enough time to explain what every letter and every word could possibly mean. But there isn't any because I just explained all of that. What are you wearing? It's a flight suit. How we doing, Frank? The signal's all over the place! Lieutenant, we need more time! We don't have time! They're coming out of the woodwork! God damn it! Lyle, what is this? Some kind of joke? Oh, it's a joke, all right. But I'm afraid it isn't ha-ha funny. What? The feather scale is off the chart! I'm trying, but it's burning up! What's going on? All right. I suppose I owe you an explanation. But fast. This is was my family. There's a terrible reason you haven't met them yet. They're dead? Worse. Seven years ago, I noticed this. Is that a... Yes, a tail. Protruding from the base of my father's spine. Beautiful in appearance, yes. But immediately I sensed its grotesque nature and what was to follow. My mother, my father, my younger sister, now they're Mustangs, Pintos, Shetland, Ponies, and I know who's responsible. Who is responsible? Eagles. What are you saying? Do I have to spell it out for you, Hannah? This is ridiculous. Putting logistics aside, why would eagles even want to turn people into horses? Because, Hannah, eagles eat horses. That's not true. Oh, really? Then explain this. Stop lying to me, Lyle. The name's Haversham, and my father didn't believe either. But now the world is rubber, and he is glue. Um... Lieutenant! We've got a lock. It's him. Eaglia, the king of the eagles. Let's get ready. Playtime's over. What? Lyle, I've been thinking it over and none of this makes any sense. Number one, if you're really in the CIO or whatever, then how have you had time to hang out with me these past months? And number two, how is it even possible for a person to be turned into a horse? Well, in regards to the first question, you haven't been with me. You've been with one of my copies. Hi, did you... Did you... you get back I... in your what? cage! And in regards to question two, the answer to that is this. After four years, we finally managed to recreate their technology. It looks like a box with a calculator on it. No, it isn't. Stop it. The device is a seismic transmitter that sends a pulse altering the genome of anybody nearby who's been branded with this special paint. <laughs> then, well then, they turn into a horse. If the Aglia is really down there, we're faced with an incredible opportunity. We can finally turn all of these goddamn eagles into horses. Why would that be helpful to you? <laughs> All right, let's turn a bird into a horse. Eaglia will enter, spill the branding paint on himself, and we can horsify him with the reactor.
Hannah, you may not want to be here when we hit the seismic reactor. It won't be safe. I'm just so confused, Lyle. Hey, come on. Look, it's just you and me, all right? What have I always said? I don't know. I'll always protect you. You've never actually said that. Listen, when things get hairy, you're gonna have to sneak out through the back door. If they catch you, you're gonna need an alibi. I'm scared. That's good thinking. Act scared. So if they ask you, you'll say that uh, you were with your boyfriend when all of a sudden he and his friends set a plan into motion that they have whenever a girl tries to move a relationship too fast. Okay. Wait, what? An expensive, complicated plan meant to scare the girl away forever. Filled with horses and eagles and all this nonsense just because he can't break up with you honestly. Just because he can't stand to look you in the eye and say, You have such... An annoying laugh. What is so goddamn funny that it causes you to create that sound? My god, woman, you sound like an overweight whale with throat cancer. Everybody hates you. I hate you. He hates you hey, so Anna, did you much. Did you take my ginger ale? Did you do it? Did you take my ginger did ale? Did you take it, Anna? We know you did. Oh, yeah, because I have a lot of things. No, I don't, Anna. I've got ginger ale. I had ginger ale, and then you drink it! You like to walk around and you steal a drink, and then you go, Mmm, this is a tasty drink, I do enjoy this. Ha ha ha! Oh wait, no, that's not how you sound. Did you take my ginger ale? How did you look at me like this when you, when you laugh like that, and you take his ginger ale, and you go around marching from state to state in your little trotty car? Did you take my ginger ale? Hannah! You sit in your fucking tower and you look down on those beverages which aren't yours and you say, I will have that. Thank you muchly. Nobody else drinks it. I'm going to shove my finger into your eye. Do you know this? You bastard. G guys. I knew something weird was going on. This is all hypothetical, Hannah. Guys. Hannah. <laughs> You have to trust I me! Guys. Leave forever, or we're doomed! Guys! God damn it, what is it? Frank! He's in the house. Trust me. This is so stupid! Frank! Frank! Sleep, Frank. You'll see the ocean again. I am so sorry. Hannah, run! on the seismic reactor, which is definitely a real thing. Great work, Hannah. Now you'd better get out of here before things really get ugly. I don't want to leave. You have to. I love you. 
Oh, 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 no, no kisses. No ki just cuz. All right, you know what? On the hand. Kiss me on the hand. There you go. Get out of here. Oh, the transformation's happening, Anna. Oh, yep, he's turning into a horse. He's turning into a horse. Look at that. Now he's a horse. Now I'm going to fight the horse, Hannah. Run. Run to safety forever away from here. Run, Hannah. What? Stop that horse. You get off of that. All right, I think she's gone. Uh, good job, guys. That what? Brian? Brian, come here. Tell him. I'm tired of being your decoy slave twin, okay? I think you should release me and give me my life. Well, I... And it's not just him. We all think this is stupid. So from now on, we've decided you have to break up with girls like we do, honestly, naturally, and painfully. Fine. Good. Now I'm gonna go get the bullet out of Frank's kidney again. Do something with your slave twin. What am I? Yes. There you go. Press B, Lyle. Lyle, you're annoying me. Lyle, you have to press B on your controller to select a character. Do it. For the love of God, Lyle, focus. <laughs> God damn it, Lyle!